guys welcome back to the channel my name is erica nicole if this is your first time here go ahead and hit that subscribe button i would love to have you and for my oldies but goodies welcome back ladies so it is top of the morning and it, it is it is an absolute beautiful day here in dallas texas as you can see, I'm up, I've made my bed, and I am ready to start this day. So um, last weekend, I did not upload a vlog, you guys, um, and I had a good time. So I ended up meeting um, my girlfriends for lunch, I'm sorry, not lunch, but brunch at um, a restaurant called Pangea, um, located in Garland. It was absolutely amazing. I ended up getting the... Uh, Belgian waffle which was layered with whipped cream and strawberries and it was so good and then I also had the shrimp and grits y'all I am not lying or exaggerating when I say that these were the best shrimp and grits that I have experienced thus far they were top-notch and um service was really good it was about Oh, we, I want to say in total, probably like 20, 25 of us. And um, yeah, service was great. They were on it. Food was wonderful. So looking forward to going back there. And then later on that afternoon, we ended up going to a lounge in Carrollton um, called Echo Lounge. Um, I think they've only been open for like a year. It's right across the street from GVO lounge good vibes only and so that was my first time um going there and so one of the ladies in our group i think that she uh knows the owner and so we were able to secure a vip area for us um at short notice because originally we were going to go to the gvo lounge but for whatever reason they ended up canceling our reservations um which actually ended up working out for for us so we had an amazing time and uh yeah but I guess you know last weekend I just did not feel like picking up the camera I just wanted to be in the moment and just really enjoy my girlfriends and enjoy my time and just really um you know get the most out of that experience but I am back <laughs> this weekend and so we have all the things planned. So um, my mom and I are up, you know, like I said, and we're actually about to go and run some errands. I need to go to Costco. I need to get to Target because I am like out of everything. And then, um, of course, I'll take you guys along. I'm going to um, haul whatever it is that I get. I'll share that as well. And then I also want to share some cute, chunky sandals that I got from H&M that were recommended um, by Shay Nicole. I absolutely love her. And uh, yeah, she inspired me, influenced me to pick up these Fendi dupe sandals from H&M. So I'll share those with you guys here um, once I get back. And then later on this evening, um, my best friend Blair, um, hey girl, hey, if you are watching, she turned 35 on Thursday and so um, I'm really big on birthday celebrations, anniversaries, so we are actually going out to celebrate her. This evening, we're going to start out with dinner at Vidora's, and then we are going to um, the comedy show at Addison Improv. Tonight, they are featuring D.L. Hughley, so just super excited for um, everything that we've got lined up for today, and then on tomorrow, um, one of my friends, Della Sean, she is actually... Um, she has a nonprofit, and she is um, having a 5K tomorrow for um, uh, domestic violence awareness. And so I'm actually going to be in Grand Prairie first thing um, Sunday morning. I'm going to be there to support and to show up and, um, you know, just to talk about more awareness and just be active in the community. I think that she's doing some amazing work over there. So really super excited to be able to show up and support that cause as well. But um, yeah, for now, let's go on ahead and get this day started. I'm going to go ahead and get my shoes on so we can get out this door. Because if you've been here for a while, you know that Costco is just one of those places that I have to mentally prepare for. I know exactly what I want. <laughs> I, I'm like, I, I have a beeline and 
I go in there and get exactly what it is that I have on my list and then I'm out of there. So yeah, you guys, I'm so excited for this weekend, but enough chit chat. Let's go on ahead and get this day started. Look y'all, we're at, <laughs> at our favorite place. The parking lot is not even full like that just yet. So that's a good sign, but y'all know I'm on a mission. So let's get in here and get out. All right, y'all, we're at our second stop. Costco was a success. I got everything that I needed. So now we're about to go in here and finish finish up our little errands for today. Right, you guys, so we are home. I just wanted to show you all um, real quick what I got. Um, Aren't you all right? So a couple of things that I always like to get from Costco are their paper towels as well as their bath tissue. It lasts us for about a good two months, so never run out of that. Um, I also like to get their laundry detergent, so I picked up three, three big uh, gallons of the laundry detergent. I also like to get the free and clear because my skin is a little bit sensitive, so I'm mindful of that. Also grabbed some of these Stacy pita chips, the Simply Naked. We have some dip. Um, spinach and artichoke dip. I'll show that to you guys in a bit. That's in the fridge. Definitely needed me some more Ritz crackers. Um, that is something that is like clutch in this household. I like to eat it with um, block cheese or just snacking on Ritz crackers in general. And y'all, my most favorite <laughs> fruit snack is the Welch's brand. Decided to go ahead and get a big boy of those. Um, because they are just absolutely amazing. And then let me just show you guys the dip that I'm talking about. Let's see, let me grab it. All right, so the dip that I like to get from Costco is the spinach and artichoke and Parmesan dip. You guys, it is so good. So, so, so good. I like to eat it with the pita chips or with Ritz crackers. Pita chips are my pe uh, preference, but either way, it's just a really, really good dip. So let me go ahead and get this stuff put up and then I will come back on and show you guys what I got from Target. All right, y'all, so I'm in my room and moving on to the Target haul, I got quite a few things. Cause like I said, I was out of um, quite a bit, so First things first, you guys know that spring is here and I'm not the type to really just do a whole lot as far as decorating for spring, but I like for my house to smell light and airy and like it is springtime. So I absolutely love the uh, Myers, uh, Mrs. Myers uh, cleaning products. So I did go ahead and pick up several of the multi-surface everyday cleaner. I use this, you know, of course, on my countertops. I use it to clean my stove. Y'all, it is clutch for cleaning your stove. I uh, lift up my grates and just kind of spray it down. And then I wipe it off with a paper towel. And um, it's, it's perfect. But I did pick up four different scents. And so this one is the Daisy scent. Uh, smells so, and these scents, they smell so authentic but it's not too flowery, flowery. It does not smell like a strong, strong flower scent. I can't talk today, Erica, use your words. It doesn't smell like a super strong flower scent, but just enough to know that it's there. So got the daisy scent. I also grabbed the lilac scent. Again, this is just another pretty powdery um, flower smell. Got that one. They were uh, $4.99 a piece. I also got the Honeysuckle scent. So excited about these, y'all. That is all I clean my um, counters with. And then the last one that I got was the Lemon Verbena scent. So got those. I'm also out of um, toothpaste and I like to, to buy the um, the three pack. And so I actually, I got two of them, one for me and one for my mom. Um, I prefer the Max Fresh 
um, with whitening breath strips, and it really does. It makes your mouth feel super, super clean. So, grab two of those. Let's see what else I got, y'all. Also picked up the big pack of Smartly plastic cups. I like to keep these on my um, coffee station. Got those. And I also got the smaller, the smaller pack here for when I take my emergency every morning. I don't like wasting a really big cup because I only pour about, I only make like a shot size with my emergency. And so I prefer the smaller plastic cups for that. So got those. I also, I can never go into Target, y'all, and not pick Runs Up something. So, y'all, this is his absolute favorite toy. Like, out of all the stuffed animals that I've bought him, he loves this freaking shark. So, I wanted to have um, a backup for him um, once the other one just gets all, you know, filled with slob and just all that stuff and gets super messy. So, I picked him up a little backup toy. He loves that thing. Let's see what else did I get. Oh yeah, my emergency that I was just talking about, I take one every single morning. Um, and this stuff, I, I live by it, swear by it. It is just, it's awesome. This is the only vitamin that I take. I probably, you know, I'm pretty sure I need to add more supplements um, to my diet, but I definitely make sure that I get this one in. All right. And I'm down to like half a bottle of shampoo. I only use one type of shampoo on my micro locks, and that is the Suave Essentials Daily Clarifying Shampoo. I went on ahead and picked up two bottles. It's only $1.99, and y'all, this stuff is amazing. It cleanses the hair so well, and I absolutely love it for my locks. Um, it cleanses my hair and gives a really good uh, lather, but it doesn't like strip my hair down just like completely dry so this stuff is amazing i highly recommend it so like i said i got two bottles of shampoo let's see definitely needed some more contact solution i prefer the opti free brand um and pure moist is uh, my preference as far as this line goes and i always get the double pack um because it just makes the most sense. I use this stuff every single day to put in my contacts, so. And y'all, I have just been missing, um, like, using cocoa butter. And some re for some reason, the other night when I was laying in bed, I was like, I want to start incorporating cocoa butter back into my regimen, just like with, you know, every time I get out of the shower, I moisturize my body. And I went on ahead and grabbed the Palmer's, um, cocoa butter in this little um, this little container and so like I said I haven't used it like in years and it just it just smells so good and with the type of perfume that I wear I feel like this would this would complement it you know really really well but yeah I've missed using cocoa butter so I went on ahead and grabbed me some smells just like, you know, such a nostalgic smell because, um, you know, grew up wearing that stuff. So grab me some of that. Oh yeah. I also needed me some more body wash. I only have one left. And so I always like to have a backup. I'd never just want to run completely out of anything. So went on ahead and grabbed me some of the Dove Deep Moisture Body Wash. This stuff is amazing absolutely love it all right y'all we're almost done I got got one more bag here and so you guys know that I am a candle lover candle loving fool over here and so I noticed that I was getting really low on my lighters and I only use um one type of lighter I don't use like the short so I I went on ahead and grabbed me several of the um, long neck lighters from Target. 
I like to make sure that I have these because I have way too many candles, not to make sure that I have a sufficient, you know, supply of lighters. So went on ahead and stocked back up on those. And I also needed some more um, dish detergent. So Dawn Platinum is all that we use in this household. This stuff is amazing. So yeah, grew up using it, still love it. And <laughs> yeah, so grab some of that. Aleve is my pain medicine of choice. I keep this in my purse. Um, I do have IIH and sometimes my head hurts. For those that don't know what IIH is, it is idiopathic intracranial hypertension. And it is where I have an excess buildup of cerebral spinal fluid um, on my brain. So yeah, I just kind of decided to throw that out there. I've never spoken about um, my condition because it's not debilitating or anything like that. But I don't know, I guess I just decided to share today. But when my head is hurting, I um, like to take the Aleve um, because it, it, you know, gets the job done. And the last thing that I grabbed was just some Jergens Ultra Healing Lotion. I like to use this only for my hands. This is what I've been um, using for years and it works absolute wonders. So that is it for the for the Target haul, but I have one more thing that I wanna share with you guys. So I follow Shay Nicole on Instagram. She also has a YouTube channel, but she is super, super heavy on Instagram. And I absolutely love her style, her style and her fashion, like it is just like top tier. So the a couple of weeks back, she was sharing a, um, a Fendi dupe sandal, a chunky sandal that um, she had come across and y'all, I fell in love with them. And so I went on ahead and ordered them. Let me show you guys what they look like. So these are the sandals. These are the Fendi dupe sandals. And y'all, they, they are so gorgeous in person. I absolutely love these sandals. And I'm not even one that does chunky shoes like that. But y'all, this sandal is everything. Super, super cute. Super cute. I got a size nine. The uh, Fendi sandal, I think it's like three, three hundred something dollars, maybe in the high twos. And these were only $34.99 from H&M. That is like stellar. So I'm going to try them on for you guys here shortly, but I just wanted to show you what they look like really quick. So this is the brown pair and they also come in black. And so I wanted to make sure that I have the black pair as well. Y'all look at these babies right here. Super cute. Look at those, y'all. They're so dang cute. I absolutely love this shoe. Um, you can wear it with anything. You can, you know, wear it with a dress, um, short set. I mean, just anything. Y'all know that I am a leggings queen. And y'all, this is going to be my go-to shoe for the spring and summer for sure. So let me go ahead and uh, um, try them on and show you guys what it looks like on my foot. And um, yeah, I highly recommend them. So let me go ahead and turn the camera around. All right, y'all. So I have the sandals on. Look at how cute they are. I absolutely love this shoe, you guys. Super, super cute. And like I said, they don't, like having these on, they don't look like super like clunky to the fact of where they make your feet look like, you know, extra big. Super, super cute. Like I said, I highly recommend these sandals. Absolutely adorable. Give y'all another close up. Super, super cute. So let me go in here and fix me a bite to eat, get all this stuff put up, and I will check in with y'all here in just a bit. Okay, y'all, so it is later on in the day. 
I've gotten me a shower and I've gotten dressed. Um, I am dressed for a fun night of festivities with the bestie. So I decided to go ahead and pull out the uh, brown faux leather pants. They are from Amazon. The top is semi sheer. This part is sheer and so are the arms. Uh, this top is also from Amazon and the shoes are from Amazon as well. Um, then I just put on my belt with it because the waist is just a little bit too big. And then um, I am wearing my Louis Vuitton earrings tonight. So super excited for all of the fun we are going to have tonight. Um, but I am about to get out of here and probably like the next next five, 10 minutes because it's getting pretty close to time. But here is the outfit. I think it is super, super cute. Love, 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 love these faux leather pants. They are everything. Love them. So yeah, you guys, let's go ahead and get ready for a fun Saturday night. Birthday to ya. Happy birthday to ya. Happy y'all so we just got to the addison improv and um i hadn't been at this comedy house in a minute but they do have this cute the alley um club um afterwards that you can go to but um uh, but yeah so we finally made it so we're about to get in here and get to our table you ready Whistle, you know. <laughs> but I'm from Wisconsin, so I'd be like, that's a call. Sorry. You know? <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'd be sending games into overtime just because I hate goodbyes. You know, like, just want to be together, you guys. You know? That's all. Um, yeah, I'm from Wisconsin, and uh, when I say that, uh, I just want to let you guys know. Enough for him. Go to dinner, you'll clap for the salad, right? Damn. Motherfucker up here selling everything I got in the bump and stick and t shirt. Good morning, guys. It is Sunday, April the 14th. If I look tired, it's because I am. Um, it's early in the morning. I got up about an hour ago. Um, got home pretty late last night. Yesterday was an amazing time. Enjoyed the comedy show, enjoyed dinner for my best friend's birthday. Um, we had a blast. So um, this morning I am up for the 5K um, walk run. I'll be walking, I'm not a runner. And i um, about to go and support this good cause. So just wanted to come on and um, say good morning. I'm about to put my shoes on and get out of here. I am running a little bit late but um, I am definitely on the way. So yeah, guys, let's go and have an amazing Sunday. All right, y'all, we are out here. We are lining everybody up so we can go ahead and get the, the walk slash run started. I am a part of the walking crew, but I think everybody looks so cute out here in their variation of tutus. 
Everybody looks so good. I think it was a really good turnout. We also have some vendors here. Um, let's see. We've got vendors um, over there. As you can see, my, my truck's parked over there in front of the tent because I got here a little bit later. So parking was pretty scarce. But yeah, y'all, we are out here and we are gonna do this thing. Out here supporting such a great cause. Thank you, Della Sean, for putting all this together, girl. Your hard work does not go unnoticed, mama. Hope you be in that group, huh? Good, good. All right, y'all, it's time. Let me let me get out here, y'all. So I ain't looking too crazy. All right, y'all, so now we're at a place called Triple A Cafe. Um, y'all know we had to come and get us a bite to eat after the, after the 5K, so. She's taking us to our table now. Yeah, they ain't nothing in there. They didn't have anything in there. Well, this work. Oh, did you like food? Yeah. I know. It is nice out. Everybody beat me. Huh? How did everybody beat me? Exactly. <laughs> right. I thought I left first. All right, you guys. So I am finally home. Brunch was absolutely delicious. And so. I know when I woke up this morning, I was already tired. Now I'm extra sleepy. So um, shout out to my mom for doing the laundry um, this uh, Sunday and uh, just making sure that all that stuff got done. I am about to get a shower, get situated for the night, you guys. It is definitely going to be um, an early night for me. Um, this weekend has worn me completely out in a good way. Um, but I am extremely exhausted. So um, I am going to go ahead and wrap up this vlog. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. There was a lot going on um, this weekend. So um, I felt like it was uh, definitely an interesting uh, vlog, different, you know, things going on. And I was definitely outside this weekend. So if you've made it this far and you enjoy my content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Um, I hope that you decide to stick around. So thank you guys so much for all of your love and support. I'll meet you guys down in the comment section. And um, yeah, I will see y'all next week. Um, take care, have an amazing work week. And um, yeah, I will see y'all in the next one. Bye.